Hey guys, Aaron here again with ScareDog.com. Today I'm going to show you how to do basic animation in your Flash CS5 project. So what we're going to do, come here on the stage, and we're going to go to File, Import Stage, and we're going to bring our car object in here on the stage. Of course this can be any picture or anything that you want to animate here on the stage. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to come down here to my timeline. I'm going to go to about 150 frames. I'm going to select my frame, just left click and select in there, then right click that blue area and go to insert keyframe. This last keyframe is going to be where we want our car to end up once we're through animating. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to left click and hold and I'm going to hold down my shift key. And that's going to keep everything in line there. As you see if I move things around it just kind of snaps back to it. So I want my vehicle to end up over here. Okay. Now if we test our movie here, if we test our scene, you'll notice that it's going to wait, it's going to pause a minute, and then it's going to snap over. That's not exactly what we want it to do. What we want it to do is we want it to move from here to here. The way we achieve this is by coming here, <clears throat> excuse me, on your timeline, and you right click, and just anywhere inside of here, just right click. Let's do Create Classic Tween and you notice as I scrub the timeline here the car is moving so let's go to control test scene you see the vehicles moving from the left to the right now it is going to snap back once it gets to the end now how do we stop that from happening what we do is we come here to our last frame and I usually insert a, um, a new layer and the way to insert a new layer is just come right here and click new layer I go to the last frame there and I click insert create keyframe, right click, insert keyframe, you can do that again. And then I come down here to my actions and then we just tell it stop, open parentheses, close parentheses, semicolon, and that is it. Let's close that back down. Now what's going to happen when you go control test scene, we're going to see it move left to right and then it's just going to stop there at the very end. Now what that did is that stopped your movie there at the very end so your movie's not rewinding or looping again and playing again. Guys, I hope this tutorial was a help to you. Again, please leave a comment, please uh, rate, subscribe, all that good stuff. If you've got any tutorials that you'd like for me to make one there, either leave a comment below or go to scaredog.com and click the request tutorials button. Thank you again for watching my video. Bye-bye.